been waiting so long for this. So long. At least we're getting both the, the, the episode 4 and episode 5 done back to back. It's like we had episode 1 and 2 back to back. Then we had episode 3 was in the middle with like a massive, massive gap between the two. And now we're doing episode 4 and 5 together. I hate it. Damn it. Strike one. I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. Flashback. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. <sighs> oh yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. Sure thing, kid. Oh, man! Thank you! Who do I make this out to? Oh, no, no. N no names. Band player signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. <laughs> Just your name is fine. D don't date it or anything. No thanks. Whatever. You sucked anyway. Dick. You gotta keep those fans happy, big star. Let's get back to baseball. That was savage. Screw that. Scumbag kid. Well, it's out of here. Holy cow. You just had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah. You should try it. Son of a bitch. Strike two. Man, knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. It's annoying. Oh, wow. Oh, sorry, David. Look, it's cool you're trying to cheer me up. Really? I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, I'd have clocked him over the head with the goddamn anyway. ball. I needed the distraction. See? We all have off days. Come on, man. Don't start sucking on my account. Damn it. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. <laughs> Ow. Fuck. No. Shut up. Stupid thing. My arm's throbbing. Garcia takes one for the team. That's gotta hurt. God damn it, Javi. I fucking warned you. Why is he being such a dick? I remember Jeremiah I with 101 how bits. Has game. a zombie apocalypse well, started yet? I need to get my bow out if it has. Return the favor. Not yet. Watch this. Oh my god, the crowd is going wild. I got it. At least not in this flashback anyway. I'm done. Thank you for the 101 bits, man. That woman has been walking around the park in the exact same way every single time. I just need to point that out. Go back and watch that. That woman in the background. David, what's wrong? Come back. I same woman walking around the same bench Instead, every single time. Show me up. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. Maybe I belong she likes back the in the army. <laughs> I had a purpose there. I had respect. Last time you deployed, you didn't have kids. So, whatever you do now, you gotta put them first. I am putting them first. That's why I have to leave. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. No, the kids are too young for you to leave them. You gotta be around the, you know, coach them on stuff. What the hell do you know about raising children, Javi? I'm not going to lie. If I go, it's going to be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, 
right? You won't leave her hanging? I need to know that. In my mind. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. <sighs> Thank you. I really mean it. We good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. Buy your beer. David's a scum. I can't I can't work out David. I've been back and forth on him all the way through. Ever since the first episode. I get can't decide it. whether I like him or not. Well not like I'll him, but go. I can't decide whether I hate him remember? or I'm indifferent. Can't you help us now? Of course I remember it's why I haven't shot you already. That's how I'm helping you. Joan's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you tried to attack her. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them. And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this, but you've got to let Joan enforce the laws. You do anything she tells you to do, huh? Go along with whatever she says just to keep your place. It's not like that. Joan's got a tough job. She needs all our help to keep this place safe. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. Yeah, maybe it is something like PTSD or something. From David. This is bad. What are we gonna do? I never trusted Joan. I didn't think she'd turn on me like this. David, hey! I thought I had it handled. All of this is my goddamn fault. I should have seen it coming, but I dropped the ball. Big time. Joan lied. You couldn't have anticipated that. It was a sneak attack. I'm glad you see that. You may be the only one. I keep doing this, making the same stupid mistakes. Remember when you wanted to run away and re-enlist? Yeah, you talked me out of it. And you fought to keep your family. You can do it again, now. Listen to me carefully. I don't care what's gonna happen to me. I'm most worried about Kate and Gabe. They gotta survive, no matter what. You don't have to worry. They're safe for now. We have to get them out of town. Both of us. You're right. No matter what we do, Joan's already poisoned this well. We've got to figure a way out of Richmond. All of us? All of us. This time tomorrow, we'll be together and safe. Let's give him you a little hug. give up on anybody. And I'm not going to give up on you. So glad to see you boys getting along. Armed escort? You're that scared to face me? Oh, David. I'm not scared of you. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not gonna be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion. Between us. You've got the guns. You set the terms. I'm glad you're willing to work with me. It's sad how we ended up here. But Clinton Lingard agree. You've become a problem. Tomorrow Bitch. morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. This place could have been something. Something good. And you ruined it. This place needs me to keep it safe. You set me up. Everyone's gonna see through your lies. I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. We'll debate all of this in the morning. Right now, David, I need to ask you some questions in private. Bring him with us. She's scum. She's total scumbaggery of the highest order. Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Hmm. 
No one's out there. I mean, let's give it a go. Yeah, locked. I'm not you never know. Out through here. You never know. They might have been stupid. No time to rest. That doesn't look very sturdy. Huh. That pipe looks loose. Let's take it. What else we got? Good thinking. It's been a long time since I hit the showers. Oh, and I could use one. Too bad there's no running water in here. Well, that's about the kind of day I'm having. Okay. I mean... Okay, I see. I see where we're going with this. Ugh, nothing useful here. Great. Well, thanks for giving me the ability could to squeeze through there. That. Really? Or you could squeeze through there without the the bars on. I'm guessing. Hmm. I'm not gonna get up there from this bench. Still, 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 still. You weren't kidding when you said morning stream. Waking up to Bruffy streaming feels weird. <laughs> Indeed. Getting this done. Smart. No chance. I've been looking everywhere for you. Oh, Gabe? Where Jesus, did you take Gabe? Dad? I don't know yet. Help me get out of here. These bars are loose. Help me pry them off. Death hype. <laughs> I can't do it. Can you help? Well, of course, just do it with him. Why are people in these games dumb? Nice work, Gabe. Like you would automatically do it hint. together. What's all that noise? It's a herd. They're outside the walls. This way. Come on. Well, that's good. Mainly because smart people in the Walking Dead zombie apocalypse would make for a most Kate boring didn't want to franchise. Stay at Dad's house. <laughs> yeah, fair Where enough. The smart me? people are just living their lives, place. not getting involved in all She's this nonsense. While they hide out. Is Kate doing okay? Yeah, she's fine. And Eleanor's watching her just in case. We should probably keep moving. I can't believe you found me. I looked everywhere. Huh. Nice work. Thank you. They've still got your dad, though. He's gonna be okay, right? I mean, these are his people. They're just arguing, aren't they? They wouldn't do anything to him. I'm working on that. To tell you the truth, things don't look so good for him right now. What? Then we have to help him. We gotta meet up with the others first. All clear. Come on. There's been a severe lack of Clem in season three. That's Kate been a main problem. 
You have to make her stay. We have to stay until Dad's free. We can't leave Dad here. Not after we found him again. I'll talk to her. I'll try to convince her. Good. It's important. Hold up. Everything's gone wrong here, hasn't it? No. In this town. You shouldn't be a prisoner. It's bad. This place is going to hell. We're gonna need to find somewhere to lay low and hope for the best. With Dad. Don't forget about Dad. Don't get me wrong, it's a good kind of weird and I can start farming bits again. Fair enough, Draconis. Thank you for the bits, man. We made it. Great. Let's get in there. Uh oh. Oh, that was close. That was close. Yeah. This wasn't so busy before. What are they up to? Come on. Let's get inside. I was just thinking that Clem was the main draw and Lee. I don't really care if any of these people live or die. Yeah, that's it. That emotional attachment that you got to all these previous characters. Not really getting it from the new ones. This looks very much like an execution. Yeah, if this was... Yeah, I guess they didn't call it The Walking Dead Season 3 for a reason, but it is clearly meant to be Season 3. But it's so unrelated to Seasons 1 and 2 that it doesn't feel like Season 3, and it feels like they changed the name of it to, the, to a new frontier. <sighs> On purpose, because they knew that it wasn't quite like a real season three. It's still better than Michonne. <laughs> season one was the best. Season two was a close second. This has been okay. At dawn. Executed at dawn, that's what's gonna happen. What? I came here to watch yesterday's stream and all of a sudden you're live? <laughs> yep. Early stream. Get the Walking Dead done before we go away to Sweden. Alright, let's get into this. If you watched yesterday's stream, you would have known. <laughs> yes, this is true. Hell, I've been thinking hard about this, and I really think we should be a thing. I'm sorry. I don't know if I feel like that. That way. I missed you. I missed you too. You know they don't want any of the rest of us like they want you. Would you be happy never seeing me again? So what about me? I just can't do this now. Oh, hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey, <clears throat> where have you been? Awkward much. Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? 
You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We just can't trust Joan. She's trying to remove David from power by pinning murders on him. Told you we couldn't trust him. I'm sorry about what's going on with David, but we should have gotten out of here when we had the chance. We still need to get out of here, Javi. Let's go. We need a plan. We almost got caught last time, when we just made a run for it. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Oh. Holy shit. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not gonna be able to go anywhere. Look at that. We should have left when we had a chance. Now we're stuck here. Issues. Least we're all still together. Look, this isn't a glass half full situation. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. We'll need to make sure we can defend ourselves, no matter what we do next, okay? Defend? That's all you're doing? I don't want to risk us losing anybody else, but you don't seem to mind that. They will be coming for us. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. The armory. Good idea. A small group should go. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on. Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. Just follow your heart. That's all any of us have left anymore, right? Thanks, man. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck. See you later, Wonder Sniff. <sighs> this is this is zombie apocalypse, and you're worrying about soap opera relationship drama. <laughs> oh, what a scumbag! The Specky Legend with the subscription. Thank you so much for the Prime subscription. Stay frosty, gents. What's that mean? Like, stay cool, buddy. Looks like Bob's on duty. I'll distract him away from the door and meet you inside. Be careful in there. There might be more of them. Remember what I said about staying cool? I've done this before, Hobby. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? I found a button. Well, thanks to Specky Legend. Yeah, I think I do. How can we trust Ava that she won't turn us in? Can we really trust her? Your father trusts her. And we trust him, right? Yeah. Then we should be okay. I hope. How do you know when you can trust someone? I 
feel like I've never really known anyone other than you and Kate, Mariana. Through their actions, they can try to confuse you with their words, but someone worth your trust does good things. Makes sense. I think we're up. She sure is a big help. The game could have done that itself, really. Ava said it'd be this way. <sighs> it's down here. The guns are through that door. Locked. No time to look for a key either. I have to do this the hard way. the noise. Real stealthy way to open a door, you're not kidding. He's got his backpack back. And his bat. Put these in your bag. <laughs> backpack back. Yes. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. Yeah, we do. <gasps> <laughs> Sorry to scare you. When we get back to Eleanor's, we need to talk to those people about doing the right thing by this place. I'll meet you at the entrance. Dead yet. I'm so sorry. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody sees him. Stupid Gabe. Let me see that wound. 
it's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility is right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Yeah, hide the body but leave the knife and the blood. That makes sense. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? <gasps> what? Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Who were you expecting? I know this wouldn't exactly look innocent to Joan or David. Is it innocent? Yes, I guess, I think so. I'm mostly here to talk with Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch Beauty that for you. Weird. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. You've done this before? Yeah, I have. On myself, actually. In much worse conditions. Ah, uh, yeah. You'll be fine. I remember. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem, are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. What? It means you're growing up, blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. You forget that your body Clem is, is you're so young. And then things change, but it'll be okay. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Clem always seems so old, beyond her years. You forget she's still young. Wake up! Talk to me! Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? Sex class in The Walking Dead. <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! <laughs> wow, that guy is really out of it. He really, really is. Yeah, they, they did read that. That that mm. clip was Not exactly the same as when we it looks like pain talked killers to her. Are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. I'm just gonna look at everything. 
Just pills. Here we go. Oh. <laughs> Good stuff. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. I think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Even Ava would have to admit. I was a good mom to AJ. Flashback. Flashback time. All right, all right. It's just me. What the hell do you want? I'm really glad I found you. Clementine, I know this is hard. I'm so sorry about what happened with AJ. Really, I, I am. Tell me he's okay. Please. He's as good as he can be. Which isn't great. Look, it's not much, but... Here. Forgot about a finger. We messed up on that one. I'm pretty sure there's a way to save a finger, right? I think I think we definitely David failed on that one. David wanted you to have that. AJ drew it just after you. This. Thank you. You're welcome. Consider it a peace offering. We care about you. Just try to remember that even if it feels wrong. People can still be trying to do the right thing by you. Listen, it's dangerous out here, and right now, you're hurting. Whatever you do, you can't let what happened get to you. You need to keep a level head. Plan for after that. You're strong, but that won't get you far if you don't know what you're doing. Or where you're headed. I could maybe find some others. Town or something. We all have to fit in somewhere, right? Just because it didn't work out with us doesn't mean you won't find happiness somewhere else. Don't stop looking. For me, 
Staying alive has always been about finding people I could trust as much as they trusted me. That's what the new frontier has been. A silver lining. Made me feel worth a damn. Kept me going in the worst of times. You'll find yours. I know you will. Someone oh, or something. Me. I used to have Lee. You never mentioned him. He took care of me for a while. Every time I would look at me. AJ, I could hear him in my head. Me. Helping me. Guiding Take me. me back to He's season one. Still with you, you know. Here. So is AJ. From the first time we met, right here, surrounded by absolute hell, you and AJ were a light in the darkness. Hope for a better world. That's who you are. Promise me you'll never lose that light. Please. It's what makes you special, Clem. It's what keeps the rest of us going. Okay, I promise. You're a tough kid. Don't change. <sighs> I should get back before anyone notices I'm gone. Those good people you mentioned before, the ones you said would be out there, well, there's an old airfield about 10 or so miles south of here. Prescott. There are definitely good people there. I'm sure they'll take you in. I'll miss having you around, Clem. You're going to be okay. Thanks, Ava. Good luck out there, Clem. Give him back Telltale, you monsters. I actually give a shit about him. That's I what know. keeps me going. There's things I have to stay alive to do. I feel bad about losing her finger, though. <sighs> so, what do you think? I think I'm getting better. Nice work. Thanks. Just glad I could help. You coming? I still have to ask Lingard about AJ. <sighs> Hello, Clementine. Javier. Thought you were rotting in a cell with David. There any chance he got out too? I hate to think about what Joan might do to him. Joan took him before I got out. I haven't seen him since. That poor bastard. He's... He's not getting out. Guess there's only one... sure way to get away from Joan these days. Why do you care if David got out? He deserves what's coming to him. If you think that, you don't know David. I know he's the reason I lost AJ. When AJ recovered... David was the one who stepped up, took personal responsibility for that kid. You say that like it's a good thing. I really doubt he was a positive influence. David's the reason the kid's better off now than, than he's ever been. You can be as mad as you want about how, about how things panned out. The fact of the matter is, David's been good for AJ. Among others. Clem is AJ's family. No kid is better off when you break their family apart. Maybe you're right. Maybe AJ should be with Clem. All I know is that he's better than he was when he got here. No thanks to you or David. I stand by what I said. If David's taken such good care of him, why did he tell me to ask you where AJ is? That's what this is about, then. You... You want to know where the boy is? What do you want? I... I just want to die. I want you to inject this in me. Hang in there. Tomorrow's another day. 
<laughs> okay. When your brother found me, he... He got me to care about everything I'd given up on. My life. Other people. Even this goddamn place. Without him around. I don't want to care anymore. Just tell me where he is! Then you won't have any reason to do it. Javi, I have to know. I've been looking for too long. I can't Jesus. lose you now. Not when I'm this close. All right. I'll do it. Well, where is he? He's... He's at the McCarroll Ranch. A few miles west of here. He's really alive. Don't forget to stick around to handle the after part. I don't want to become one of those monsters. Don't forget, Joan's looking for you. And your friend. You better hope she doesn't find you. I've got it. Jesus, this is morbid. Huh. Finally. Oh, hey. Uh, hi, Clementine. Surprised to see you here. Yeah, right back at you. You all good? Yeah. We're all set. Let's roll. Mm, good to see you. The doctor didn't want to live anymore in this world. I felt like I had to. Zexy kept him alive. Oh, really? Okay. Harvey, you're I wonder back. what changed. And Clementine. Thanks for the warm welcome. Just surprised to see you is all. Oh, hell. You okay? Yeah. It looks worse than it is. Don't worry about it. Kate's lying down in the other room for a bit. So you got the guns, huh? We got them, all right. One for you, and one for you. I saved this one for you. No, I've already got one. Rejected. Actually, it wouldn't hurt to have another. Thanks. What took you so long? We went to see Dr. Lingard. At night? I'm kind of surprised he was sober. It's got to be a stressful job, looking after an entire community. He was definitely not 100% there, that's for sure. Sounds about right. Why don't you go talk to Kate, okay? Okay. The sun will be rising in a few hours. Joan's people know we're holed up here, and they're gonna come looking for us. All of us. Ah, for fuck's sake. Maybe it's not as bad as we think. Fucking figures. And there's no going anywhere with those things blocking our exit. They like me, that has to help somehow. Just cause they like you, doesn't mean they're gonna like the rest of us. We're sitting ducks up here. We can't just wait around here to get shot, that's for damn sure. Hey, we can do this. Yeah. We've gotten out of tougher jams before, haven't we? I mean, sure, but this is different. We can't just cut and run, not with the herd out there. Like it or not, we're fucking stuck in Richmond. Now how the fuck are we gonna put the brakes on this thing? Joan and her people are going to be at the square, right? We need to bring the fight to them. We go after Joan, our problems are solved. 
Great. So, how do we do that? It's a good question. Joan will probably have a full security detail with her. She'll be insulated from us and from anybody in Richmond who doesn't agree with what she's doing. If there are good people left in Richmond who are against what Joan's doing, we need to ask for their help. If we can talk to the people at the trial, present the case to everyone in Richmond, we might not have to do this on our own. We light the match, the people do the rest. After we take Joan out, we're gonna need some way out of this mess. Now, I don't know about the rest of you, but I'm not much of a runner. We've got a truck, a big one, that we used to use for walker defense. It's a little busted up, but it's way better than nothing. People are gonna be patrolling these streets looking for us. How far away is this truck? I'll show you. We've been expanding, pushing out further, making the safe zone even bigger. Can't promise you they've cleared all the walkers yet, but that's where the truck's parked. I could spit and hit it. We steal that thing, nothing will be able to stop us. Steal what? Hey. Jesus, Javi, is that blood on your shirt? You said it wasn't that bad. It isn't. How the hell did this happen? Oh, you're bleeding right through that bandage. You should have told me as soon as you got in. Things went a little sideways at the end. Gabe got in the way. A guard came after me and he stabbed me in the shoulder. I thought you guys were gonna be careful out there. Hey, don't worry about it. It is what it is. Thought you knew what you were doing. You're still alive, aren't you? Eleanor, can you take a look at this? As long as he keeps it clean, it should be okay. Would you guys stop making such a big deal about it? It happened. It's over. Move on already. I'm just trying to make sure he's okay, Gabe. What we need to be talking about is the plan. Oh, I have a bunch of ideas. I want to be the one to go after Dad. Just give me a gun and I'll do whatever. I know the town. I know what Dad's going to be thinking. Hey, 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 slow down, would you? You're getting way ahead of yourself. Who's to say you're even coming along, kid? Are you fucking kidding me? Ugh, this is bullshit! I'm Gabe, not you're a total behind. liability. Gabe, Sort yourself out. He's my dad. I'm going. It's going to be dangerous out there, and I don't want anyone else getting hurt. If we get to save dad, then getting hurt is worth it. It's worth dying for. This is more important to me than anyone else. I've got a gun, and I know how to use it. You're out of control, Gabe. First the shit at the armory, now this? How am I supposed to trust you to do anything? How are any of us? Nobody here is gonna let you be a martyr, Gabe. Your life is precious. Life is precious? Then how come you shot Conrad, huh? Back in the tunnel, when he came after us, he tried to bargain with you. But you thought killing him would be easier. I saved your life too, in case you didn't remember that part. So what? You shot him. You killed him. What the fuck, Javi? Is she telling the truth? You murdered my friend? God what damn it. What the fuck did you do that for? You looked me in the eyes, man. He had a gun on them. If I hadn't killed him, he was gonna shoot Clementine and Gabe. He's telling the truth. When Conrad found out that I used to run with New Frontier, he went crazy. He would have pulled the trigger, no question. I guess we'll never know, right? Because he's not here to tell his side of things. You made sure of that. Looks like you're a pretty fucking dangerous person to be around, Abby. First you kill my friend, then you get me and my friends on Joan's shit list? I think you need to give us some space, Javi. Fuck that. I don't want to see you ever again. Or maybe I'd be better off with Joan. At least I know she wants to stab me in the back. You get the fuck out and you stay gone, or I can't be held accountable. You feel me? We can take care of ourselves. Hell, we stick around you much longer. You'll probably kill us too. I'm sorry it happened the way it did. Really. Conrad wasn't a bad guy. The situation was just... just fucked. We better go get that truck. I'll, uh, get my stuff. Then call you on the walkie when I see things getting started in the square. Gib is... Oh, my God.
See, I wonder if this is... I wonder if this is where... If I'd spared the life of Conrad. If I hadn't shot him. Maybe we would have had those two with us at this point. I don't know. I don't know. I'm, I'm always intrigued about come the... come with me to get the truck. The potential other options. You guys hang back here. And how it would have Be worked. Be ready for anything. I see what's going on. You're punishing me because I told everyone what you did. Right? Screw that. I'm going to get the truck. You stay behind and keep watch. You proved your fucking point already, Gabe. Now it's time to grow up and help us. Hey, Gabe. Come on. I need you to watch my back on this one. Yeah. Okay. I guess somebody needs to be a lookout. Oh my god. What? Nothing. Gabe and I will be fine back here. Gabe is such a scum. You might chew a little shit bag. What do you want, Javi? I know it sucks sometimes, but you've got to be a team player. It's about thinking of everyone. I get it, okay? Just quit treating me like a kid all the time. Ruffy hates teens, old man, bro. <laughs> this thing looks like it moves too slow for an escape. What's going on? Thanks. For what? Helping out with Gabe. He's having a rough time. We all are. I'm just doing what I can. Let's keep looking for that truck. You got it. Guess they'll be using that for construction once they've cleared this area. Here we go. There she is. There it is. Let's go. What are the chances? I'd say about 50-50. Smart ass. Before more people wake up. What are we gonna do? We can't start the engine. Not without attracting a lot of attention. Kate, you steer. The rest of us are gonna get behind the truck and push. See if we can't get some distance between us and them. Okay. Ready? Ready. I feel like this isn't Ready. the best idea we've ever had. How does his baseball bat stay in his bag like that? Surely it would fall down because it needs to be the other way around. 
It needs to have the, the thicker part at the top. Otherwise, it's just going to fall. Turns out you needed me after all, huh? Yeah, but I swear. I'm just saying. I know you didn't want me to come along. You know, I'm just trying to keep you safe, don't you? Uh, yeah, but... But nothing. <clears throat> you want to keep doing stuff like this. You got to learn how to follow directions. Don't think those guys will be able to hear the engine all the way over here. I put it in neutral. Couldn't find an ignition key in there. Guess you'll have to hotwire it. Try not to shock yourself. Shit. I'll need something to strip the wires. They left all their supplies lying around. Bet there'll be some tools out there somewhere. Just try to hurry, okay? Uh oh Almost there. Keep an oh, eye out while I get it started, okay? I'll check on the guys in the office. Clem and I will look out for walkers. Okay. Here goes. Up with this. Learning how to hotwire a car and walking dead. There you go. Got to connect the battery to the ignition. Let there be light. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You can just turn the lights off. I'm standing in oh, sick of this. <laughs> it's always the same. At least it follows the repetitive nature of the TV show. <laughs> I've never actually seen the TV show. The square is a couple of blocks away. This is a good place to wait. Do we have enough gas? This has felt I'm so slow. This one. Again. This what one's now? reminded me of one of the Michonne we wait for episodes. Ava to call us on the walkie. So, nothing for us to do but sit and watch the sun come up. Well, I know we've got something important to do. I'm teaching you to play Euchre. That's not a real thing. It's a card game. Come on, it's fun. It's nice to be driving around with a couple kids in the back seat again. Really Where takes you back, doesn't it? Just you and me and Gabe and Mari. Better times. You're right. This is nice. Like if I just close my eyes, we're right back where we were. All of us together. Do what I do. Try to think about the nice stuff, not everything that happened after. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, come on. That's not even a good rule. Still gotcha. Guess he stopped playing it cool with her. Hmm? Uh, in case you haven't noticed, Gabe's got a little crush on Clementine. He light likes her. You get it? Well, okay, I, sort of I hope it works out for them. Okay, so I really do. They're good for each other. 
I think. I think their first official date will be target practice. Ben skinning and eating a wild animal. Uh, young love. It's so normal, you know? Like, as crazy as things get, as terrible and tragic and just plain stupid, there's nothing more wonderfully ordinary as two kids falling for each other. Not that they're there yet, but to feel something that intensely for another person, kind of like the best drug there is. Hey, the falling in love is the easy part. It's the staying in love part that'll really mess you up. It's unfair, that's all I'm saying. That they're feeling what they're feeling right now, and when that sun gets a little higher, it's right back to the fight. I just wish he could have had a childhood, you know? I wish I could have given them that. Him and Mari, both. They deserved better than this. Better than what got handed to them. That's why we're doing this thing, right? So he can have a better life after everything's said and done? You're right. I know you're right. I hope you know, Javi. Having you there with me, right by my side, all this time... That's what made the difference. You're so sure of what you're doing all this for. You didn't run away. You could have. But you didn't. I'm here so I can set an example for people. For Gabe especially. Someone to be proud of. Someone who sticks around. I get it. There's no graceful way to say this, so I'm just gonna say it. I know we've had moments. You and I. And there are always a little hot and a little confusing and maybe some of them haven't meant anything at all. But before whatever happens tomorrow happens, I need you to know whatever this thing is between us, I want to give it a chance. And I know the fact that David is back in our lives now makes this whole thing a little more complicated. But do you feel the same way? I'd really like to know before things get crazy. We might not get another chance. <laughs> Life's too short. Let's go for it. We gotta try, right? Oh my god, really? Really. So are we gonna... Oh, there it is. There's the kiss moment. Okay. Yeah. Shit. We're doing this. You do realize we're gonna have to have a weird conversation with David, right? It's the right way to play this. He already got the sense I was pulling away. That would be the stand-up thing to do in this situation. Can I just say how lame doing the stand-up thing is, though? Oh, it's super lame. Javi! over here. She's planning to hang David in front of the whole crowd. Told you. You've got to get over here now. Told you it was an execution. Truck. If they see it, they'll kill him right away. If you can just get into the square. Shit. We got to get over there now. I'm going to hang back here with the truck. Keep the walkie close by. We'll tell and you David, well, that makes things easy. <laughs> yeah, talk not needed anymore. Good luck. Nothing else from Ava? Nope. And it sounds like a crowd out there. It sounded like Ava got cut off by something. Or somebody. Wish we had some idea of what we're heading into. Like, is the whole plan shot? Or did she just have a little setback? I hate not knowing. I'm getting a little worried about Ava. Something must have gone wrong. Something must have happened. We're not gonna know what went wrong until we actually do this thing. So, let's do it already. Maybe Ava's you been ready? playing us all along. Ready as I'm gonna be. 
glad to hear it. I agree with what you guys were saying in the chat, though. Gabe definitely does not deserve Clem. Clem's too good for Gabe. Gabe's a little shitbag. can't wait for the others, can we? For years now, Richmond has been governed by one simple principle. Strong council, strong community. But, unfortunately, the actions of one of the members of that council, our security expert, David Garcia, have put us all She's in... lying to all of you! I'm sorry to have to show you this. Truly, I am. But you all need to see. Just look what he's done. <laughs> David ordered his brother and the rest of his people to kill our doctor. And they were happy to do it. Is this who we want in charge? Someone this reckless, this cruel? Not if I have anything to do with it. I can't believe this is really happening. She's gonna kill him. She can't do this to him. Try to keep your cool. Joan's smart, but we're smarter. We just have to be careful. We can't screw this up, Javi. Javier! I heard you were planning to crash our little party. Why did you come on up here? Show your face to everyone. I'm sure these people would like to hear what you have to say. Happy to. Been waiting for this all day. Then I'll try not to disappoint you. We both know you killed Dr. Lingard. Why, Harvey? Why would you do that to us? The only surgeon in a hundred mile radius, but you didn't care about that. Lingard saw what was happening in Richmond, what you were trying to do. And he didn't want any part of it. He asked me to spare him the sight of all this. You ask me, he's better off. Sorry if I don't take your word for it. Too bad you killed the only man who could back up your story. I had a very interesting conversation with your friend, Eleanor, last night. Isn't that right, Eleanor? We did. She said you were coming here to rally the people against me. Convince them that I was no good for Richmond. God damn it. Don't know this how is not you going well. Going to pull it off, considering it's all of us against the three of you. And that's exactly what I'm planning to do. Appreciate the honesty, which makes this so much harder. Here in Richmond, people who put themselves before the group don't last long. Bring them out. Get away from me! You're making a mistake. Ava! Oh no. They had them this whole time. David wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? Something like that? I can't just let it go. You've put me in a no-win situation here. So I'm going to do the same thing to you. Both of them deserve to die for their crimes. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Joan! Don't! Not after what they tried to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. If you're going to punish anyone, it should be me, not them. So ready to sacrifice yourself for others. Don't worry, Javi. I'm not through with you yet. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? This all is eyes are on I feel like they're oh my Maybe god, this, this will is help terrible. To your mind. This Boys? has gone south. <gasps> Come on, This Harvey. has gone south. Who's it gonna be? Your friend, or your brother's lieutenant? 
Oh, for God's sake. Oh, come on! This is fucking stupid! You can't be serious. God damn you, Joe. Uh... Do the right thing, Javi. How could you do this? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I can't answer. I can't. Okay, so that's what happens when you don't choose. Oh, this David game. wanted to tear this whole place down. He told his people where <laughs> to find our gun supply, and sure enough, they <sighs> picked us clean. You really thought you could ride into town and stage a coup? With our own damn weapons? See, Ava's been Something really like good, that? but Trip, I didn't, I like, can't I just feel bad for getting Trip into it. You've put me in a no-win situation here. So I'm gonna um, do I think the I'm going to save you. Ava. I think Ava's the one who I want to save. She's crimes. the one I'm leaning towards. However, Javi, I'll let you spare one of them. Just one. No! Hell no! Don't! Don't! Why is it... Why is it replaying all this again? Not after what like they tried had... to do. You may be guilty of bringing them into this, but they chose to go along with it. Joan, are you sure about this? We never agreed to killing all these people. It's really up to Javi, isn't it? All eyes are on you. Maybe this will help you make up the, your The mind. deciding factor is that Ava Boys. was kind to Clem. And Clem is the only one I give a shit about Come in the on, whole Harvey. entire thing, so... Who's it gonna be? <laughs> and that's your where friend, it goes. Or your brother's lieutenant. Let Ava live. She's always been loyal. Javi! No! Well, there's the Javi I know. Backstabbing, double-crossing, no good, dirty fucking murder. Such language. But I admire the sacrifice you're making here, Javi. Shoot her. Wait! I said don't shoot Ava! You did, but there's something else you need to understand. Betrayal. Joan, think about what you're doing. Ava's one of us. You can't fucking do this. This is fucked. I can do anything I want. You brought this on yourself. Do it. Wait. Oh my no! God. Oh my God. They really shot her. Oh God damn it. Now, David, it's your turn. Okay, this turned bad. I can't believe this. This turned this bad. This is how we do things. This is madness. Stop her, Clint. Is this the process you trusted? No. Think about this, Javi. You know what's going to happen here. You ready for that? We don't murder in Richmond. We exile. That's how we've always done things. How about you take David and the rest of your people and just get the hell out? Go far away from Richmond, and then whatever you do is up to you. I'm sure the herd outside would like that. She thinks she's sending us out there to die. She's counting on it. Everybody put your guns away. We're gonna handle this peacefully. Don't listen to them, Javi. They're fucking butchers, all of them. Shoot that bitch! Take her out! She deserves it! If you don't do it, I fucking will! Oh my god, I want to shoot her so bad, but... Let me out of here! I'll tear her apart! We're leaving. All of us. Right now. I didn't say you could go. Doesn't matter if you did. This is how it needs to happen. any of you take your deal and shove it they're liars clint all of them one step closer and i kill him i swear i will go ahead and shoot then i warned you they can't be trusted stop a second and think about this i'm done thinking ava was the best soldier i ever met she didn't deserve this <laughs> Ah, 
This has all gone to hell. This has all gone to hell. This is not... I feel very bad about all the decisions I've made during this game. Oh my god, he's killed him. David is a loose cannon. This escalated very quickly. Fucking hack! Get back here! Okay, I need you to cover me. We gotta make things right. Okay. Dad needs us. We gotta get out there. He needs you, not me. Go on. Thanks. this up I told you what he was like when are you gonna start believing me Shit, get down I hear I mean, gunfire right. what the hell is going on over there are you guys okay stay away from the square it's too risky we'll come to you I, I trip is a you. good guy it's too loud trip is a good guy to be fair Okay, she just decided to not listen it's to me. Kate. She's coming for us. Uh oh. Oh my god. Oh god. Javi, you've got to get over there before. <sighs> It's all gone to hell. It's all gone to hell. It's all gone to hell.